No? 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 What are you doing? All right, a lot of you have loved the uh, cheating videos I've done, and so we got another one in store for you today. We're gonna go over some of the, the, way, the things you need to watch out for from the crazy people out there. Let's go. What are you doing? Take a free drop. For what? Burrowing animal. What, you had a burrowing animal? Yeah, right here. What animal? I don't know. There's not, I don't, where was it? That's it. You want me to put it back? Yes! You serious right now? What? That's a nice lie. <laughs> Alright, so uh, this one's burrowing animal rule. I mean, okay, you could take a burrowing animal relief, for sure. But you see what he just did? He took relief when I was way over there, and then he put his ball back in the perfect lie. This happens all the time. You gotta watch these guys in the rough. Cheating all day long. Oh, burrowing animal. Burrow Even when there's a burrowing animal, there's a lot of shadiness going on. Can you have me a nine iron? We've all seen this on tour, right? Uh, the guy, <clears throat> Patrick Reed, uh, takes a, uh, a wood and he smashes down his lie in the rough. There's grounding, and then there's uh, grounding, which we call Patrick Reading. And then you're like, oh, I'll take a nine iron, because you only got like a 140. Why do you got this in your hand? You've seen this, you gotta watch out for those guys in the rough. That, this is where they do all their uh, um, improvements. Gosh, this guy would never do it, but there's some that would. Keep your eye out for the guy who grabs a, the wood in the rough from 140. You see what I did there? You didn't even see it, did you? That's a tricky one. I know. Okay, watch. See, you gotta watch out for a two ball guy. He's got uh, two different balls in his pocket. One is for hitting tee shots, because it's hard as a rock and goes forever to unspin. And then, when he's in the fairway, he, he checks his ball real quiet like. And then, and then he looks at it, and then he puts down his soft little spinner. You know that guy. Call them two balls, and they cheat like crazy. So be careful. All right, the majority of the uh, the uh, infractions happen here on the putting green, and there's some things you're gonna have to look out. But you're gonna have to keep your eyes open, otherwise they'll zip right past you and never know what happened. One is this: you gotta watch out for a 45 degree rule guy. Okay, what he'll do? You know about uh, he he'll always want to mark his ball and get it out of somebody's line even if it's your through line like he'll make up stuff so that he can mark his ball and then move it with his putter head and then what he does is you're supposed to go parallel right from your line pick a tree in the background but he won't go parallel he'll go 45 degrees the wrong direction and mark his ball like two putter lengths and then when he replaces it he goes 45 degrees in the other direction with a different tree and puts it you could gain a good like two or three feet if you know what you're doing. So you gotta watch out for that dude because he'll, uh, he'll shave a couple feet off his putt. All right, the next guy is this. It's, it's the marking the ball guy. He's like the David Copperfield or the, uh, David, the, the magician man of the uh, marking his ball. There's many different ways they do that, but typically they, uh, they do the flip move with the coin and the ball, they would do one of those. Or what they'll do is they'll, they'll mark their ball in front of their ball, the, right? put the mark in front of the ball, totally illegal, but then when they replace the ball, they put the ball in front of the mark. And you just think it's normal, because you don't know what he did the first time. So you gotta watch out for like magician man, just how sleight of hand stuff happens all the time. Be careful out there. One more. It's the most sly one of all, kind of my favorite, but uh, totally illegal, come on. All right, this is, this is the culprit here. You see that? Right there. All right, so, now these are cool, they sell them. Got this for $12, kind of expensive, but whatever. Uh, and But notice, they're thicker, okay? That's the key element here. You can do it with a thin one too, but what they do is, this goes on the green, totally fine. But, while you're not looking, they do, do the old slide-a-rooney. 
That's what we call it, slide a Rooney. What they do is they just slide it along. Boop, boop, and they keep raking it forward like a nut ball, and then you don't even know what's happening. Next thing you know, a, a 20 footer turned into like a two foot birdie putt. You've got to watch out for these guys. They're the worst culprits of them all. <sighs> There's a lot of crazies out there. We got to get them, we got to wrangle them, we got to throw them in the pond. All right, hey. My, my, Mike doesn't cheat. He's legit. He's a good player too. He'll wax the floor with you. Anybody wants to take us on, he's my partner, right? Uh, why not? But we're going to watch out for you because there's a bunch of uh, shady characters out there. You've seen a few in your uh, high school coaching days, right? Yeah, I've, I've seen them in high school. I've seen them in college. I've seen them on the mini tour. And uh, yeah, it's never a good thing when uh, you get caught cheating. It's just once a cheater, always a cheater. And just never kind of lose that uh, persona. No way. So uh, keep your eyes out there. Hope you had fun in this video. Be sure to like, uh, comment, subscribe, and let us know what you see out there on the golf course. Follow Golfholics. Love you guys. We'll see you in the next video. It's mine. <laughs>